shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. Au commencement était la parole, et la parole était avec Dieu, et la parole était Dieu. La parole était au commencement avec Dieu. Tout a été créé par elle. Sans elle, rien n'existerait. En elle, il y a la vie. Et la vie est la lumière des hommes. La lumière brille dans la nuit, mais la nuit n'en a rien fait. Il y eut un homme envoyé de Dieu, il s'appelait Jean. Il est venu pour témoigner de la lumière, afin que tous croient. Lui-même n'était pas la lumière mais il est venu pour la faire connaître. En venant dans le monde, la parole qui est la vraie lumière éclaire tout homme. La parole était dans le monde, le monde qui fut créé par elle, mais il ne l'a pas reconnue. Elle est venue chez elle mais les siens ne l'ont pas accueilli. Mais à ceux qui l'ont reçu, à ceux qui font confiance en son nom, elle a donné le pouvoir de devenir enfants de Dieu. Ils ne sont pas issus d'une lignée, ni de la volonté charnelle d'un homme, mais de Dieu. C'est ainsi que la parole a pris corps et qu'elle a planté sa tente parmi nous. Et nous avons contemplé sa gloire. Une aile d'ange.
and line to the throne. Shakira gave birth to her first child, Milan. Channing Tatum almost won the name game by calling his daughter Everly, possibly in the hope that she would one day have brothers. And then Kanye West and Kim Kardashian were blessed with little baby North, trumping them all. Even Tom Daly hadn't ruled himself out of the race in the light of his sensational end-of-year proclamations. Perez Hilton became the proud papa of Mario Armando Lavandera III Hilton. The virgin birth doesn't look quite so special after Perez, does it? Well, we must press on. In Nazareth, Mary was going about her business when an angel visited upon her and told her that she was the chosen one. A detail that often gets left out in the retelling is that the angel was called Miley. And my, didn't she just come in like a wrecking ball? She told Mary she had been selected to give birth to the Immaculate Conception, the one they would call the Son of God and future inspiration for Madonna's greatest hits. Mary hiked aboard a donkey and traipsed the streets with her luckless partner, Joseph. When they reached Bethlehem, they knocked on every door, trying to find a hotel to welcome the saviour of the world. TripAdvisor had not been invented back then. It was a land long ago. Airbnb did not stretch to Bethlehem. They landed upon a lowly stable. Oh, this can't be right, can it, said Mary, as the animals grunted around them and Joseph set about his carpentry skills to rustle up a new crib for the forthcoming tot. We should call it shabby chic, replied Joseph, brandishing a copy of Pearl Lowe's Outpost in the Shires, as featured once more in the style supplement of the Sunday Times. I know you would prefer something a little fancier, but anyone can do shabby and on a budget too. Mary could feel herself going into labour. Oh no, she exclaimed. I could have doubled up with a caesarean at the Portland and had a little facial work done at the same time. Joseph and Mary looked sad face, for they had no money. The sponsorship deal to hook up the birth live on YouTube had fallen through at the last negotiation. But these are times of austerity, reminded Joseph kindly. We're all in this together. And lo, a baby was born into broken Bethlehem. He came in like a wrecking ball, I will call him Jesus, said Mary. Alas, Kanye already has that, reminded Joseph. Then I shall name him after Kanye's album, with a ghetto twist, she replied. Jesus it is, they exclaimed together. And they wrapped the baby in swaddling leather leggings, which they invented, FYI. According to popular legend, the three kings arrived. King Harry, King Zane, and King Liam. And no one cares about the other two. You must travel in one direction, they said wisely, and offered their gifts. Gold, frankincense, and a night out at the alibi with Cara and Grimmy on the occasion of his 18th birthday. Some shepherds were tending their herds in a field nearby when they saw a star shine brightly in the sky. It was the light of the world. It is the star of the northwest, said one to the other. Kenya already has that one, said another. The angel Mary appeared in the sky to tell them of the news. Today in Bethlehem, the son of God has been born. It's his party. He can do what he wants to. He is called Jesus. But Kanye already has that one, said everybody. Oh, I am sorry, replied the angel. Jesus it is. And so it came to pass. The saviour of the world was born. <laughs>